Well, it's one thing to see a bear in person, but to come across one in a city park in the middle of a neighborhood may be unheard of. But that is what happened to one Gibson County teenager over the holiday weekend. Eyewitness News' Cody Bailey met with the teen earlier today, and Cody joins us now live in the studio with his reaction. Cody? Yes, Shelley, what appears to be a relatively large black bear was spotted, as you mentioned, in the middle of a residential area in Princeton, Indiana. And this close encounter was all captured on video. Oh, there's a bear! What started out as a typical day for 14-year-old Aiden Smith turned into anything but for him and his friends. We were playing basketball and then we went to the dugout and we came back over here and started listening to music for a little bit. And then we looked over, me and my friends, and then we seen a bear. Aiden says he saw the bear inside Princeton's Southside Park, appearing from a nearby bean field. Unsuspecting at first, Aiden says he was soon in disbelief of what he witnessed. At first we thought it was a dog. But it wasn't, it was a, it was a bear. And then started walking that way to where the woods are. A popular city park surrounded by houses on every side makes this bear sighting even more unusual. That's just strange. It's very weird. But I mean, it did come out of the beanstalk over there, so. Other social media reports indicate possible bear sightings over the weekend in Gibson County, including the town of Potoka and another at Severns Bridge near State Road 65, also in Princeton. Should you encounter a bear, Indiana DNR encourages residents to maintain a safe distance, avoid climbing into a tree, and wait inside your vehicle or a building until the bear is gone. It is also important to never feed a bear should you come in contact with one. Aiden says he plans on following that advice should he come close to a bear once again, and even says he would record another video despite his startling experience. It was kind of scary, but like I said, a bear is a bear. Don't chase after it. Don't yell at it. Don't throw anything at it. You won't hurt it, and it won't hurt you. Now, Aiden says he and his mother did contact the Department of Natural Resources regarding this sighting, and if you should have a similar encounter, you are also encouraged to report those sightings to local DNR officials.